One of the main resources you're going to use every single day in your projects are icons and in this video I'm going to show you some resources that you can use, some free and some paid, for your UI UX design projects. Hey designer Alex here, welcome to the channel and welcome to this video about uh, icons in UI UX design projects and where you can find them. But before we jump into today's video, make sure to check out my membership, link is going to be down in the description below. Membership contains all of my courses, digital design products, private access to the Facebook group, practice files for these YouTube videos and much more. So if you're interested, once again, link is going to be down in the description below. Now let's get started with today's video and the first resource which I want to show you is is this it's called icons 8 and as you can see you can get uh, these apps for Mac OS Windows you can get a plugin for Figma for Google Docs Photoshop and Illustrator not yet for Adobe XD but you can simply copy from your Windows or Mac app and paste it into Adobe XD they have some free uh, icons right here but they also have these premium icons and whatever you see pricing on these websites uh, that means that those resources are premium and you will have to pay for them but on majority of cases you're going to find free versions either in png or svg whatever you have svg option i will strongly recommend that you go for that because png is really not that uh, great quality if you have to scale it up or down all the time for example if, if you have to use the same app in your mobile uh, app design or your website design at the same time for example then that's not going to be a great option however However, if you can use an SVG icon, then it will be a fantastic option because SVG does not lose quality. So once again, you can jump right here where it says icons and you can see PNG and SVG icons in 35 different styles, which is great. And I always tell uh, designers this, wherever you can find these styles, because you can then form your design in this particular style. If it works for your client or your personal project or whatever you're doing, then you can push it in the same style. It's going to look coherent and it's going to to look like it does belong to each other you can see right here so they have the free app with all of their graphics they have these plugins and you can see all of these icons right here including animated icons and i'm going to come to them a little bit later but as i said you can download it you can test it out and see uh, which one of these free apps are uh, sorry free icons are available on icons 8. next up we have noun project and you can see they also have pricing but they have majority of these icons free uh, so for, for the free versions and you can see they have all of these different categories from uh, plans to at the office technology pets education and so much more so if you're interested you can check them out and you can see they also have apps and plugins for windows and for mac and they also have uh, this adobe plugin which i think just works in photoshop and illustrator i think don't hold me accountable to that you can check it out if you want to and they also have pricing and licenses so same thing like with uh, icons 8 you can check it out and simply copy and paste from their desktop app to adobe xd or whichever software you want to use next up we have this awesome looking animation from orion icon library and you can see how it looks like right here they also have gopro version which means once again that uh, these icons are premium ones and as you can see they have 6000 free svg vector icons which once again is fantastic so as you can see they have a line solid color and flat of all of these icons which is fantastic so no matter which style you want to go for then you can take it out from here so once again they have these free svg icons but once again uh, majority of their other icons are premium so just make sure to pay attention to that and i would really recommend that if you can and if you decide that you really like one of these icon packs and one of these websites i really urge you once you start getting some money make sure to pay for these icons because these guys spend months in creating these icons thinking them through drawing them on a piece of paper then taking them into the software making sure everything is optimized and easy to use for you when you download it and use your uh, use it for your own personal or commercial projects so once again make sure if you can if you get the money if you really like these icons any one of these icons which i'm showing you then make sure to support the creators and make sure to pay the money which they're asking from you in order to use their premium sets of icons 
next up what we have is this lord icon and this is the animated icon library so you can see they have over 1700 animated icons and these animated icons are great especially if you're losing using something called loti files which i explained in one of my previous videos basically loti files is this great extension which allows you to animate your icons and then simply copy and paste that code into your browser for example or if you're using webflow you can integrate it with webflow and basically with one click you can get this animation and get the code Code for the animation you can adjust your colors for example or your clients colors and then simply copy and paste that code and get it in the live website so when your users see that live website they're going to see that live animation happening in real time which I think is fantastic and why I bring this up basically Lord icon gives you two options one option is static icons so all of these icons that you see right here are looking basically like this so they are completely static but you can integrate them on hover like this or you can integrate them in your uh, hero section, for example, your testimonial section, your product section. So no matter what your users are doing, you can easily integrate these icons into your project. Once again, they have some free version and as you can see, 280 free icons and 1400 premium icons. So once again, make sure if you like these, make sure to support them and you can check out their pricing right here. Next up, we have Envato Elements, which I spoke about many times here on the channel, which is one of my favorite uh, of all times. And you can check right here to see the icons. And the reason I like it so much because a lot of these websites, which I show you right here are just for icons. And if you take a look at some other shops, they are going to mainly focus either on UI kits or something creative, like for example, uh, graphic design templates or something like that. Some of them are using social media templates and stuff like that. While here on Envato Elements, you have absolutely everything. On one of my previous tutorials, I showed you how you can utilize their 3D and then save it out as either PNG or PSD and then use it in your projects. So once again, you can check it out. And of course they have millions and millions of these icons and the reason Reason why I like them so much is, for example, you really like these icons and you really like this style. Well, you can see that it's created by this guy called Crafted. You can click on their profile and you can easily explore all of these graphics which are created by them. So you can see they have map and navigation icons. Well, you can simply scroll down and see majority of these icons are in exactly the same style like this one for example is and you can use this one as well so that's all great when you're working on a project which requires consistency so for example if you're working with a home-based uh, business or for example a business which is selling homes or something like that or you're using something for tools and e-commerce if you're setting shop like that you can easily come right here and use this exact style in your project and then it's going to look coherent rather than taking free icon from here free icon from there and then simply end up looking not professional at all so once again i would really recommend it and you can see all of these categories right here on the top each of them has additional categories and subcategories like this one and as i said in the previous video i really like their 3d function as well Next up, what we have is Icon Scout. Once again, they have a free version and they have the pricing. So you can check it out right here. You can start using, you could check the repository on GitHub and see the styles right here. So we have the line, monochrome, solid and thin line. So I would really recommend for you guys to check out and to see all of these icons. So you can see over 1400 icons right here. And finally, what we have is Streamline, which is one of the biggest packs on the internet. So if you like icons in this particular style, style once again they have multiple styles but uh, the way that they created it is its own sort of style so you can scroll down and see so you have five day free trial to access all of these icons so once again over 100,000 different icons and you can see they have free PNG and premium SVG so that's the thing what I was talking about before if you really want that high quality you would really want the SVG icon because you can scale it out endlessly you can scale it up and down it really doesn't matter it's not going to lose quality but if you end up using PNG icons it is going to lose quality especially in software which is not vector based 
or bitmap based for example like photoshop is then you are really going to end up losing a lot of the quality so that's why i really recommend for you to use svg icons wherever possible you can see that they are taking all of these icons and um, presenting them in all of these different packs so once again you can uh, start your five day free trial or you can browse all uh, free png and premium svg and you can upgrade right here and to see the prices of course they also have illustrations they have emojis which is great in today's time and they have these different tools which you can also explore so you can see they have streamline streamline bolt regular colors mini bolt mini line streamline freehand cyberline and so much more so once again make sure to explore all of them streamline and for all of these icons i'm going to leave the links down in the description make sure to check them out make sure to explore them and to see what works for you but that's it basically for this video. I really hope you like some of these resources. And once again, make sure to check them out. Make sure to try them out for yourself and to see if some of these icons uh, do work in your projects. And once again, if you can, make sure to support these creators, no matter which one of these you choose. Because as I mentioned previously, they really do spend a lot of time to make sure to create these icons as easy to use as possible and to give you as much variety as possible, like they do right here, for example with these 100,000 icons, illustrations and emoji for your projects. So that's it for this video. Once again, I really hope you liked it. If you did, make sure to subscribe and make sure to hit that like button. I upload new videos every single week right here on the channel about Adobe XD, design, passive income techniques and much more. So if you're interested in content like that, make sure to subscribe. And once again, I'll see you in the next video. Take care.